Hello, and thank you for watching. My name is Rachel Barnett with Gentle Frog. I'm here to create videos for you to help you understand QuickBooks slightly better than you currently do. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please put them in the chat box. Thank you. Let me show you how to get to your accounts receivable or your customer balances. Let me first start with the mistake I see new bookkeepers make just so that I can show you why I'm creating the video. So I'll often work with a new bookkeeper who will go to the balance sheet and then they'll say, oh, there's a value in accounts receivable. Let me click on the number because that works for almost everything except for this one thing. When you click on the accounts receivable number, it's going to bring up a list of all the accounts receivable transactions, payments, everything. The running balance on the right, that's not your running balance for any particular client or any particular invoice. That's the running balance for accounts receivable. So helpful, but not really helpful. So this is why I'm making the video. What I think would be better, more useful, more efficient, more productive is to search any other report. <laughs> so I, I like the accounts receivable aging summary. It shows me who owes money and how far past due are they and what's the grand total that they owe. Maybe that's not the report that makes your heart sing. Let's go back to the report list. If we scroll down into who owes you, there is this like really great list of reports you can look at. So I'll just show you one other one, um, the customer balance summary. Customer balance summary just says, here's the people that owe you money. Here's how much money they owe you. If you want to know more about why they owe you money, you can click on the total and it's going to show you a list of their invoices, or in this case, one invoice. This is going to be the same as if you had gone over to the left hand side, gone to sales, gone to customers, click on in, and then you can see open is 850. Um, you can look at the status. I only want to see my open invoices. Here's my open invoice. There's just a variety of other reports that I think will get you whatever you're looking for faster than clicking on the accounts receivable line on your balance sheet. I hope this video has been helpful. If my team or I can do anything for you, please don't hesitate to reach out. We offer one-on-one -on -one training, self-study courses, and outsource bookkeeping. Thank you so much.